I'm Gordy Willis, Managing Director of Cooper North America, and we're the exclusive distributor for the Cooper Blade products. Uh, Cooper is, uh, has been making snowplow product for approximately 40 years. They started with, uh, with various rubber materials and then over time gained expertise and knowledge uh, incorporating different wear materials or actually vulcanizing wear materials within the rubber blades. And uh, we've been bringing them into this country now, into North America, for approximately six years. And after six years, we're now in over 30 states and six Canadian provinces uh, fielding the blades. Yeah. So really what we show here are two primary products. We have a carbide product where the carbide holder, the sections are free floating, they're vulcanized within the rubber, but then we also take the extra step to vulcanize uh, Hardox 400 plate front and rear. So this gives the ability for the blade to cut very well, cut compacted snow and ice. Uh, it also helps when you're mounting the blades because the blades come in standard size sections. You hang them, set your bolts, torque them and forget them. There are no, there are no face plates or other adjustments that have to be made. And the other product we're showcasing here uh, is a ceramic cylinder vulcanized within a rubber blade. And this product is primarily used where other customers use a lot of rubber snow, snow plow cutting edges. Uh, and again, because we have the ceramics, the wear material vulcanized within the rubber, uh, these blades last eight to 10 times as long as a traditional rubber blade. And people tend to use these wherever they might have raised obstacles, manhole covers, expansion joints, uh, and in many cases, particularly in the slush belt states, where they have raised pavement markers uh, on the highway. Because the blades won't mark, mark the pavement, uh, they won't take any of those pavement markers off, they'll glide right over. Uh, and of course, too, because they, they have ex extended life, uh, the maintainers aren't constantly adjusting or flipping the blades like they do with rubber. Conservatively on the carbide product, we like to say three times life expectancy over, say, a traditional or a premium carbide blade. Of course, it all depends. Some customers get a lot better. Last year was a very interesting year. As we know, there was very little snow, but we still had plowable events where they were sending out the crews, but they're, they're plowing you know, three quarters bare dry pavement. So we actually saw increased wear in a, in a snow year where there's less snow because, of course, snow and moisture reduce friction.